Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Fallout 4. My name is Brian, your host and commentator, and here we are. We're going to be exploring... <laughs> well, here we are outside the theater in the Kitty Kingdom. Gage wanted to talk to us, so why don't we go ahead and hey, chat it up with him really boss, quick. Can we talk now? Sure, man. Everything is okay? Everything okay? Yeah, sure. All things considered. Just been thinking is all. That whole thing with Coulter. I know we talked about it some, but... Uh... It could be a sore spot between us, yeah? I mean, here I went and turned on the overboss. Who's to say I wouldn't do it again? Um, <laughs> don't screw with me. Don't worry, Gage. I don't believe that you'd betray me. Okay. Okay, good. Look, Coulter was a piece of shit. I've been real clear about that with you. But that, really, that was all on me. I'm the one who talked him into being over, boss, in the first place. If he was so bad, why help him in the first place? If he was so if bad. I'd known he was <laughs> get so bad, I wouldn't have. Right then, I thought Coulter was what this operation needed. Big, strong, didn't take shit from nobody. The gangs would fear and respect him, and he'd listen to me. I'd use all my years of experience to help him run things. But he was stubborn. Let shit go to his head. Ain't the first time I've seen it, honestly, but it was one of the worst. What are you saying? You've made a habit out of doing this? No, no. This whole Nuka World plan was way bigger than anything I'd done before. One thing I've learned over the years, being the guy in charge also means you're the guy with the biggest target on your back. Whether it's another gang looking to take whatever you've scraped together or some punk thinking he knows better than the boss, there is always, always someone gunning for you. I don't want that target on me, but if I can be the guy just behind the guy in charge, well, that suits me just fine. If I got his ear, I can steer things in a direction that benefits me and usually everyone else. Where are you going with all this, Gage? <laughs> Hell, boss, I ain't good at this. You ain't like Coulter. That's what I'm getting at. You ain't like the other raiders I've run with. So far, you make a pretty damn good overboss. And it's been fun running with you. I'm just saying. I'm starting to be glad we teamed up is all. All right, fuck it. Aw, you know Gage. I'm glad we teamed up too, buddy. Let's continue, shall we? All right, we need to go. Where do we need to go? So we need to go right. Let's see if we can... Actually, I don't think there's a northern um, entrance to this place. So we'll probably have to take the western entrance. So let's go ahead and wrap around down here and go to the... Uh, get, go to the exit. Get the hell out of here. Which I... Oh, I'm totally going the wrong way. Okay, we need to go this way. Here, maybe we could just hop over all this stuff. Like, that's uh, the... Uh, yeah, here we go. We'll go th cut through this this way, and then boom, we'll cut through all this. Here, we'll just go down. We'll go down here. Oh man, I just bumped the hell out of the mic. My foot was like caught on the. Yeah, let me reposition this. It's like caught on the thing. I don't know. I'm always bumping this mic. It's in my way. Okay, here we go. I think we're getting close. Yep, okay. Let's go up these stairs. I don't know how many... I'm not sure how many... Uh... Damn, dude, my mic stand's just all fucked up now. Here, let me pull this up a little bit. And then adjust this. Oh, come on. Alright, groovy. Hopefully this will work. I'll try not to be too... <laughs> I'll try not to be all movie, movie aroundy. All right, let's go over here. I may, ha I don't know. I'm just having a tremendously difficult time finding the way out of this place. Oh. Cause I don't wanna. Well, maybe there isn't an eastern exit. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let's just hop over this wall. Fuck it. 
Maybe we can do that. Oh, there it is. Damn. It's right here. So it's like building was in my way. I just had to go around that. Okay, cool. Let's get the hell out of here. We're going to go to the world of refreshment, which is right over here. Don't know if this is going to be in one episode. That's what I was getting at earlier. Looking at the time, probably not. But who knows? Maybe we'll get through it real soon. We've got one Cappy clue to get here. We're going to be getting one of them in the world of refreshment. We're also going to be getting uh, a, what are they called? Oh, a star core. We're going to be getting one of those. Remember, we need 20 of them. There's 35 total. Most of them we're going to get in the galactic zone. But uh, we're going to have like, what, three or four before we get there maybe? Claim your gang's hall from Kitty Kingdom. Got a nice little miscellaneous quest. I'm actually going to take that off of my thing. And here we are. And then we've got one park medallion, which we're going to nab right now before we head on in. It's right here. Here's the world of refreshment. Started a world of refreshment. It's like a water ride that you're supposed to just chill in, you know, and ride through. So this is the entrance right here. There's nothing particularly cool. There's like a, there's a gunner over on the other side of that wall if you want to go kill them. That's really it though around this area. I'm not too worried about it and I don't think you would be either so let's just, yeah, we're going to go on in. It's going to be fun. The cabbie clue is going to be inside as well as the star core. We're going to be getting the cabbie, uh, <laughs> the cabbie clue first because it's along the Basically, we're going to go through the rides. Um, we're going to take the rides uh, waterway here. We're, we're going to be following the path of the of the ride. Holy crap, that good ride. Oh, I'm going to heal up now. Go to town on it. We're going to be taking the rides uh, route. And then we're going to have to explore the little background areas of the behind the scenes. Stun you again, these nuka lurks. Dealing crazy amounts of damage. <coughs> oh, Grenade your sprint. Let's kill these guys. We gotta clear the interior right now of all these nuka lurks. And then we're gonna go ahead and clear the exterior as well. Here's the first stop. Now there's a safe behind this chair right here. This is the, I don't know, like the lab room or something. Um, that's an expert door. That opens up a middle, like, hallway area. We'll get to that later. It also opens up a area to, like, the other, to another room. This place is pretty cool. I like it. Oh, jeez. This is reminding me, it reminds me of Bioshock. Kinda. I don't know why. I mean, I guess I'm, I do kind of know why, but it reminds me of Bioshock. For some reason, this hallway. That's cool. I'd like to do Bioshock on my channel one of these days. Holy crap. These nuke alerts are putting the pain on me. Alright, so we're entering this western town here. Western town. This is where our cabbie clue is located. I'm gonna go ahead and take out these guys first, though. Should I? Ah. Boom. 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 Kill him. Take him out. Whoa, he went flying. I love it. Oh, I just I walked right into that. Slaying the nuclear spawn like it's cool. Let's give him a critical. Why not? These guys don't get stunned from critical punches. <laughs> Whatever. There's a hole there that leads into the background area. We'll check that out later. You can, oh, there's a nuclear lurk over here. Wreck engage. Oh, that was like right in the right in the stomach. I was like, Gah! he's like, oh man. Just took a knock the wind out of him. That's why he froze up and... Holy crap. That's why he froze up and... <laughs> then just didn't do anything. Alright, this guy's getting annoying. 
Just gonna keep slapping your ass. There we go. All right, cool. Is that all of them? No, of course not. Why would it be? These guys are everywhere. This is Nuka Lurk City. All right, is that it? Is there an enemy in here? Yeah, I was gonna say there's probably some in these eggs. Kill these guys. We're not gonna go through that door because, like I said, we'll do all that background stuff later. A bag of cement and a couple of bottle caps. I feel like bottle caps are just like useless to me now. Did you get them all? Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. See, there's a door here. We'll unlock that later. I want to leave doors locked so I know where I have been and where I haven't. All right, the cabbie clue is right here. Let's go ahead and equip our glasses. Cabbie glasses. They enjoy regional favorites, such as the it's the letter R. Okay, that's another clue found. That's another clue. All right, put on this helmet. I don't think you really need to kill the spawn in order to uh, make sure this place is cleared, but I don't know, I'm doing it anyway, so well, whatever. The, the star core is going to be later on in the background area. I think I said that earlier, I'm not entirely sure though. But I think that's the case, and that's, that's going to be the last collectible we get. There is a set of power armor, it's not really collectible, but it is pretty cool, so. I guess I figured I'd bring that up. It's a Nuka Cola like set of power armor too, but we're gonna be getting that. We'll be using that when we head outside. But for a good portion of the inside, we're gonna be running around killing these guys. Mysterious stranger. He's like, I got your back, Brian. Ugh! My Nuka Lurk down. They're like. Oh, that was my last stim pack? Whoa! Whoa! Okay, well, I'm gonna have to use my... I have a lot of plasma. And this thing freezes. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna use this for now so I can stay back. Here's the bar. It's like the third area. We had that... The lab, and then, the, see, there's the door that, that leads into that same hallway as the, uh, the lab. These guys like to hide in the ground, too, and then they'll pop up. See? <laughs> He's like, hey! Who disturbed my slumber? I did. Oh, jeez, he is closing in. Do I get another one? I do. Maybe I should use. Yes! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. He's been he's been not doing so hot lately, but these last two he's he's got my back right now on the world of refreshment. The other few times he showed up, well he did kind of help me against Oswald when I had to after I died and had to go back. I made a little clip of that. Here's that Nuka Cola armor I was uh, talking about. Nuka Cola power armor. He's a little inside the whole way. Blow out that machine! Blow out that machine gun! Blow away that machine gun! We're gonna go in there later. We'll be doing that whole like corridor in one fell swoop. All right, I don't even know what I have equipped right now, but here we go. Damn! I should have had a. Actually, I'm gonna save that plasma grenade. Building my criticals on these little guys. There's another one. Just hiding under the water, getting shot. My guy, like, turned around immediately. Alright, you bastard. Ooh, I only have a 65% chance of that. Yeah, whatever. The shell will kill him eventually. Just give him two shots. He's, like, gonna go for the head, but... Woo! <laughs> These Myrlurk hunters just bounce all over the place. When they get killed, it's hilarious. I love it. 
This guy just did not care about that, uh, that, uh, Molotov I threw at him earlier. He was like, I don't care. Wasn't that bad. Jeez, oh, he's turning around very slowly. Dude, I'm shooting at his head. Why are you shooting so low? See, he was about to go flying. He was going to be like, boing! But then he disintegrated halfway through the air, so that was pretty cool. And then we got what? Another, yep. Got another clown. That's right, I called you a clown. Oh, I should have saved that. I, I wasted that on that one. Well, I guess I got a spawn with it. Took out a nuclear spawn, so it wasn't all a waste of my time. Oh, he's closing in. Oh, jeez. Woo! Alright, uh, so we still have some more. These guys I have like squares that are on the same level. Oh yeah, there's a That's right. Oh shit. I hope I'm ready for this. Oh, you'll see what I'm talking about. Alright, well here's a first aid thing. I'll take both of those, why not? I'm going to save that stim pack, however. Oh, jeez. That was an Assault Tron. Um, laser. <laughs> That's what I was talking. Ah! Oh, my God. That's what I was talking about. I was like, oh, I don't know if I can handle this. Oh, jeez. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. I have one stim pack. Ooh. Oh, I should have prepared better. I did not prepare at all. Let's use a buff out. Um, a med X for sure. Oh, I have new Coca-Cola Quantums. Woo! I have four of those. That's good. I'm Van Where's Okay, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit better about this now. I'm not going to lie, guys. All right. Well, anyways, yeah, uh... You know what? I don't think a Molotov's really gonna do anything. So, like as a last resort, I'm gonna clip that plasma rifle. Shit! Fuck! He has his laser. Oh man! Dodge the shit out of that. Two lasers coming at me. Oh! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Leave me alone! Oh, we 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 got an invader. Uh. Eat it. Do the splits while you die. I like that. You look good doing the splits. Oh, shit. Oh, there's two more. Oh. That's my health at. Ooh, okay. Yeah, time to time to bust out a quantum, I think. Still 600. Fuck yeah. Oh, man, I need to use a stim pack, though. Oh, he's charging. He's charging up his thing. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, Jesus, two of them. They're like double smack attack. Both of us. Oh my God, and that guy's. And that guy's charging up. Oh. Oh, jeez. I don't know what Bethesda was thinking. Let's just send four assaultrons at him. In Meyerlick City, why not? Holy crap. Alright, that got intense. That got intense, yo. Um, alright, well, yeah, I guess <laughs> Gage went down quick. He was like, yo, I cannot handle those fools. And I'm like, I don't blame you, man. I am the overboss, after all. Oh, jeez. Okay, well. I don't know if I want to use that stim pack. I'm crippled still, right? So it'll get rid of that. There's not really too much of a threat left. All right, I'll use it. Welcome to the Nuka Cola World of Refreshment. I gotta stop by every single first aid kit on the wall that I see. So we'll head in here first. This is a dead end. Lead you back to the little ride area. We can go over here. There's where Gage was. All right, let's go ahead and I think we're gonna plan on clearing. Yeah, this. Yep. Okay. So there's a hole you can drop down. 
into I was gonna clear the not, not there yet um all right so this is where you have to go cool okay now I know where I'm going so we're gonna we're gonna clear out this whole little stretch here of hallway we'll see what I mean by a stretch stim pad let's open this door and then we'll go in here you got yourself a workbench. What else is in here? I think there's a turret in here, too. Yep, there it is. Oh, there's two turrets. Let's get that other turret. Alright, cool. Now that we took care of that, don't forget this Nuka K ticket roll here. It's a lot of tickets. Let's see where this goes. I think this... I think I know where this goes. It leads out to like a little room that's like... That has a hole in the wall that goes to the river. That I showed off earlier. Yep, it is. Cool. This is where I was like, I wonder if there's some in here. And then, yeah. Alright, great. So, um... Clear down here. Alright, so let's go up here. So we're basically going to be done with this little area. Section, whatever think uh let me there's really anything i need from these guys this leads you back to the wild west section it took almost two or not the wild west section never mind but it leads you to that little the nuka town section on one of the rooftops so let's go back down here we'll go through here and before i read that i'm gonna read that terminal so don't worry but i gotta unlock these doors Got a few things to read in that oh, that terminal. Boom! There we go. So this leads to the laboratory. Yeah, the laboratory um display. And this one leads to the bar display. Ooh. I, I maybe it's more left. I'm going too far. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> That was having a hard time. There's the bar. All right, cool. And let's go ahead and read these terminals. <laughs> staff memos. Grand reopening to all ride staff. After being on vacation for the past month, I'm sure you all are excited to be back and earning a paycheck. So let's see those smiles. We've only got a couple days before the grand reopening, and if management doesn't feel like you're suitably eager and enthusiastic, you can be replaced. Don't forget, we can uh, we can still decide to go fully automated for the reopening. So buck up and ride the quantum. In fact, I've been told by the beverage beverageers that if you are feeling a little low on energy, you can drink the quantum right out of the river. This new Nuka Cola quantum is so packed full of energy, and it fills any bacteria it touches. So drink up. Oh, it's a river of Nuka Quantum. That's right. I was thinking it was water. I don't think I said it was water, but yeah. Anyways. It's a river of Nuka Quantum. Forgot to mention that. Nuka Bar automated till further notice. To all ride staff, management has decided that the Nuka Bar section of the ride is to be automated only until further notice. Despite numerous warnings that actors are only to simulate drinking Nuka Cola Dark while staffing that section of the ride, Jenny fell off the stool and into the river. She's fine, but the nurse said she had a blood alcohol level of .37. Damn, she was trashed. After only two hours into her shift. <laughs> While we appreciate her enthusiasm for the Nuka Cola products, we also have to maintain a safe environment for our guests, one of whom lost their glasses when Jenny hit her head on the boat. Ooh, ouch. Smacked her head on the boat. Stick to the script. To all ride staff, I understand that some of you have come to work for us from other amusement parks while abiding, uh, oh, while ad libbing was permitted or even encouraged. But here at Nuka World, is it, I'm sorry, I said where. I said while. I meant where ad living was permitted and even encouraged. But here at Nuka World, at, we ask that you stick to the script. For example, the Wild West section of the ride is to be staffed only by cowboys or cowgirls. It is not to be staffed by Nuka Girl, Zaytans, Clowns, Knights, Pirates, Gorillas, Ninjas, or Sea Monsters. I didn't see any of that stuff. Whoa. 
some of those other creatures. No more pranks. To all ride staff, it has come to our attention that a number of pranks have been played on workers in the bottling plant. Be advised that these kinds of pranks, of pranks, <laughs> are not in keeping with the culture outlined in the Nuka World Employee Handbook. For example, filling a tray of empty bottles with dry ice and sending them into the, ca uh, the capper so they explode when sealed is clearly in violation of safety protocols. I'm sure when Randall gets out of the hospital, he'll probably say it was hilarious, but Nuka Cola is paying it for his eye surgery, so management finds it less funny. Indeed. Ride display scripts. Brad Burton's lab. Brad Burton actor. Boy, all this science sure does work up a thirst. Assistant. But sir, all we have is coffee, water, and a variety of other boring beverages. Brad Burton actor. Hmm, that won't do at all. Well, I've got an idea. Pantomime creation of Nuka Cola. So he mimics making Nuka Cola, mixing the things, whatever. Assistant. Sir, you've done it. This is delicious, and I can feel my heart racing. Brad Burton actor, Eureka! So long, science, hello, refreshments. I'm getting really into this western town. Cowboy one, gosh darn it, I just can't do anymore. Bert, I can't throw hat on the ground. Cowboy two, what's the matter, Roy? Cowboy one, I just got darn busted, or I, I just got done busting a Bronco, and I'm more tired than the three-legged mule pulling a road of rock up a mountain. I can't do this, I'm such a bad... Accent. Cowboy 2. Here, drink this delicious Nuka Cola Wild. The authentic root beer flavor will give you everything you need to get back to riding in no time. Cowboy 1. Go, 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 go. Time to go rustle up some Broncos, Bert. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking cringy. Jesus. Bartender. What can I get you, uh, get you to drink, miss? The patron responds. I don't know. All these drinks take forever to help me unwind, and they usually taste terrible. Bartender, sounds like what you need is a Nuka Cola Dark. Patron, tell me more. Bartender, you'll be ready for the night after your first drink, and it has the delicious taste you know to expect from Nuka Cola products. Patron, anyone here want to buy me a Nuka Cola Dark? Wow, what a freeloader. You want to buy me a Nuka Cola Dark because I can't afford it for some reason? I don't know. So there's that, and then there's. This way leads down to a hole in the wall along the river ride, and uh, we want to go in here next. Burnt book. Alright, so we have a note here. Some more reading to do. Go into the roof. This is from the Gunners faction that was holding up in here. We'll, we'll see them in a second. Running up to the roof for a minute to see, uh, to see check if this is some sort of military training exercise. Signed, Casey. That was a weird sentence. Let's go to the systems control terminal and unlock it. Let's see here. Bedrooms. Synopses. Uh, entrance. Uh, oh boy. I don't. Damn. Genetics. What was it? Two? So, entrance had two. I can't implants. Maybe it's some implants. Got it. Yeah. All right. Access subsystem. System error. Cannot access those. Bummer, dude. Security door. We'll open that. That is the security door for that power armor. By the way, BTW. Ooh, we got an enemy down here. Oh, it's an assaultron. I thought I killed all of you. Shit. All right. Pop him a few more times. Give him a one, two, three. <laughs> oh, he did. Ooh, ten fusion cells. I'll take those. All right, and that completes clearing it. Cool. So, nice. We are done with that. So, there are kind of like two sections here. Uh, yeah, we'll go to this one first. There's the mixer station, by the way, where you use your... Nuka Cola recipes when you have the the junk or whatever required the ingredients, and here are the gunners, Sergeant Lanier. Oh boy, let's go ahead and ooh a stim pack. I need that. I'll take that purified water too since I'm so low. Let's go ahead and play uh, this, this is whatever. As far as I know, last living member, of Sergeant Lanier's recon team. We tried to secure the bottling plant. And here's the Star Corps. Run by some new breed of Meyer lurk. 
I've never seen anything like them. Blue glow so strong, stronger than any Commonwealth luck I've encountered. It's got to be the quantum running through this place. We breached their nest, and they... Womp womp. They poured out. We fell back, but I'm pretty sure one of those damn lurks made off with my leg in the process. Private Clay dragged me to safety before I sent him to warn the others back at the camp, but... Uh, I could hear their screams from here. I know the help's not coming. And I'll be damned if I'm gonna be food for some mile or more, so... I'm taking this matter into my own hands. This is Corporal Downing. Signing off. For good. <laughs> For good. Yeah, so dramatic. Jeez. Calm down. We got another hole here. This is... A section. Um, let's see. Let's go up here. Attempting to do a quite thorough kind of search of this area. That'll lead you out to the upper area of Nuka, Nuka World. We got some other things to do, though. And there's also, like, there's like three exits that we can take to get outside of this uh, place. We want to get that power armor, though, before we continue with that. So, okay, and we're back here. All right, yep, so cool. Let's Let's go over here, then. Let's go up top. Through this door. Is that, that way's a, is this way a dead end? Yeah, that way's a dead end. All right. Go get that power armor now because it's on the top side. Uh, damn, that's not the right way. Let's so go over here. Put this gun away too because it's kind of inhibiting my running. Minute. Just a little bit, just a wee bit. Where's this lead? Welcome to the Nuka Cola World of Refreshment, now featuring a river of Nuka Cola Quantum. You know what? I'm just going to go back to. Yeah, here we go. Okay, cool. Found it. That's too far. Other way. All right. <laughs> to the left. Take it back now, y'all. We're 32 minutes. Man, this is going to be a long episode if I make it one episode. I'm going to make it two. I don't know where to like s split it though. The outside section is not going to be nearly this long. So. Did I go too far again? Damn. See, I was distracting myself like talking about walked right past it. Talking about like the, ah, the length of the video. Let's go ahead and get in here. It's going to help us in the outside area that we're going to be heading to <laughs> quite a bit. And as you can tell by the way I'm, I don't know, hinting, it's going to be, we're going we're gonna to have a bit of a battle. We're not quite done. We just cleared the interior. we got to clear the exterior now. we got a whole second half to deal with. Let's jump up here. Right, I'm going to stop running because it's getting really difficult to control this power armor suit in these tight corridors while running. So we need to get out of here now, though. So let's get out of here. Nuka -Cola let's go this way. Twice the calories, Not that way. Twice the carbohydrates, or yeah, twice was it that way? Actually, did we go this way? I think we did. Yeah, this is where it kind of splits off. Blue glow. Damn it. God, this place is confusing. So sorry. I hate all these, all these fucking corridors and shit. So I was supposed to go this way. Son of a bitch, dude. So sit back and enjoy the ride. Oh yeah, I wanted to check these out. I forgot about these. This is locked, I think. Yep. Let's go ahead and see what's in here. Maybe it's maybe some shotgun shells. I don't really need fusion cells right now. I want shotgun shells to give the What's his face? Gage. Yeah! Alright, well, there's a stim pack, so that's cool. Alright, yeah, see, this is, it was right in here. You could have. Could have seen it. Alright, let's go over here now. 
and we'll go ahead and head on outside. We can't, uh, there's a, there's a big room, there's a terminal that you can use to unlock a door that leads outside as well down low, and there's a tunnel that leads you outside, like, into, like, the bottom, like, area, like, you can use, I don't know, like a sewer, sewer type of tunnel, I guess. You can say exit. But we're gonna go with this one, because I think this is gonna put us a bit higher up. Give us a bit of a height advantage for all the Mario Lurk C after they're gonna have to they're gonna have to come to us. Actually we should, we're gonna have to work our way up here anyway. Alright, you know what? Let's just go down. Fuck it. Boom. Because we should probably deal with this first. All right, well, there's a there's a Mario Alert Queen, or a Nuke Alert Queen. I was hoping it would... Apparently, it's not popping out. I was trying to make it kind of intense and surprising, but that wasn't happening. Hell no. You crazy for that one, Brian. Oh, shit. Maybe you have to kill enough of these guys beforehand. And then she's like, ah, you killed all my, my, my babies or something. Time for me to rise from the water. Dun, dun, dun. Man, he's on fire this episode. In the world. Of, he's like, I actually, I really like the world of refreshment. So I'm going to help you out here a lot there. Oh, oh, okay. That's just a nuclear. I was like, is that the queen emerging from her underwater lair? Just a nuke alert, though. It was a tease. Ah, he's like got me trapped against this wall. You got me up against the wall. There it is. Okay, here's a king. Nuclear king. I'm gonna kill your queen after I kill you first. Okay. Oh, just three bottle caps. Oh, jeez. There's the queen. Hello. How you doing, girl? Uh, let's... Alright, here we go. That kind of backfired a little bit. Oh, wow, there's a lot going on. Alright. Since there is so much going on right now, um, I'll use a buff out. Uh, I'll use a Radex. Fuck it, why not? Um, I don't really know if I need to use a jet, necessarily. I'll probably use these, though. Get into here. I'm gonna get into open ground so that way I can get them all. Fuck, I'm like stuck and I don't. Oh, okay, cool. I was like, I don't want to let go of this because it's gonna whatever. All right. Oh, and fucking nuclear king took some damage. That does a lot of damage to the king, too. My explosives are, I believe, maxed out. Let's use our last Molotov on her. Maybe use our plasma grenade too. And this fight real quick. Alright, she's dead. She's tumbling towards me. These bozos. Hit it. Like, what the hell? Should probably heal up, too. God, this guy will not back the fuck off. He's like, ha 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 ha. He's like, snipping at me. He's like, ha 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 ha. Like, click, click, click. He's gonna get me. Alright, so what's left? Oh, we got a hunter over here. Of course, we got a hunter. Always got a hunter. Fucking hanging out. So I'll get that one, and then fuck it. I have five. I didn't... Okay, I was like, I didn't use it on that one, did I? It's like, I got five critical hits. I might as well use it. All right, so we got one more. One more enemy. He must be over here up top. I'm guessing on the roof. The other entrance right there leads to the pipes. That's the pipe entrance. If you take the pipe entrance from inside, you would emerge through here. And then here's the other, um, 
exit entrance or whatever you want to call it. Requires terminal. I should probably go unlock that. Maybe I will. Maybe I will show where that's at. I wasn't really thinking about it. I was like, fuck you. We're already outside. Who cares? Here's another gunner. Bottle cat. Got ourselves a terminal. Oh, maybe this terminal. Oh, no. This is a spotlight control. I don't care about that. I don't need to f turn those on or off. That doesn't matter. I don't need to fuck with that. So this leads up over there. Okay, cool. Cool. Who's the last enemy over here? Is it a king or a lurker? King. Just chilling. Hanging out on the hanging out on the rooftop. Just being a goddamn king. You know how it is. Kapow! Kapow! Oh, where's the other one? Oh, jeez. Just fucking execute him. <laughs> Blow his head off, literally. Alrighty, cool. That's all the enemies um, in here. I'm gonna turn this light on. Make it, make it a little easier to see. Put that weapon away, too. Psycho, blood pack, why not? Casey's password... They hit Boston. They hit Boston! This is really happening. Janie's college is out there. The hell with the evacuation protocols. I have to go find her. Raul, if you find this, sorry. I couldn't stick to the buddy system. Good luck, Casey. Um, There we go. And then we'll go ahead and we basically have to go to the top of that. That's where you raise the flag. Oh, whoops, running into shit. See, these things are a little like, it's kind of like a, it's a little floaty or like a little like, more like a car or whatever. I don't know. You have to kind of do like, you can't just cut a hard right <laughs> when you're in a power armor suit. Ooh, there's Kitty Kingdom. Off in the distance, we were just there. We've conquered. This place looks a lot different. I did this in uh, I did this during the nighttime. So when I was out here, I was looking at Kitty Kingdom, and it was it was the nighttime, and I'm like, hmm, the hell is going on? There's dry rock. There's <laughs> this is cool actually. I'm gonna take a minute here. This is the space zone, whatever galactic zone. We're gonna be hitting that last. Okay. There's dry rock gulch, which I'm not entirely. I guess it's a western zone. And we kind of had a western town in here. That's like a western zone. And then over there is the safari zone. That's next. That is the, I don't know, it's like the big tree there. Safari looking tree type thing. So yeah, that's uh, that's the order. We're going to be hitting that one next. And then of course the dry rock gulch area. And then the galactic zone where we'll use all these, uh, all these uh, star cores that we've been accumulating. Let's go ahead and ride this all the way up to the top. Not too much to explore up here. Did I just... I thought I heard like a machine like... <laughs> like a like a turret was about to attack me or something. Alright, flagpole. We're gonna go ahead and give this place to the operators because I feel like it fits their theme a bit more. Well, this is... different. So the disciples have Kitty Kingdom. That's the only one I'm gonna give them. Yeah, I don't think you actually have to give one. It looks like you don't have to uh, give one. Um, like you don't even have to give a gang one. You could probably. I wonder if you could give all five of them to one single gang. But uh, I'm gonna do like I like I went over that one quest. So I'm gonna do two, two, and two. I'm gonna have these, the west zone and the. Uh, I'm gonna have the safari zone and the wild west zone be under the pack, and then I'm gonna have the galactic zone be under the operators, leaving the disciples of Kitty Kingdom. So when they rebel, I wonder, see, I don't even know if you, in my practice profile, I gave this to the pack, the uh, Kitty Kingdom, and then I gave this to the operators. I'm actually going to not give any to the disciples in my other profile and see just if anything different really turns out or happens. So let's go ahead and ride this back down. So I want to, I don't know, this is kind of a long. I mean, we're at like 45 minutes. I could end the episode here and be like, we're done. This is a new world bottling plant, but... I feel like there's still 
things to be completed, and I may, yeah, just extend this into two episodes, because why not? Because why not? Um, well, here, first things first. I want to... Oh, wait, there's also... Or wait, it's in data. Data, right? No, it's not. There's, um... Shit, I don't know where it's at on the map. I forgot. There's, uh, there's that stash that we gotta grab, too. Here, I'll tell you what. Let's go ahead and... I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and unlock that door. That'll be the first thing I do, because I know I have to do that, and I know how to do that. We'll hit up that terminal. Maybe the password gives us access to the terminal. So there's the terminal. And you know what? We're going to go ahead and enter from the uh, from this way. From the sewage. Let's go ahead and enter through the sewers. Not sure which side has the... It doesn't look like it's this side. Oh, yeah. It's right here. Never mind. Duh. It's right in front of you, Brian. Yeah, it, um, okay, so what it does is it gives you access to the, uh, bottling plant. Um, the staff terminal. That's what it is, I guess. I don't know. So that's the entrance there. See, we were in this room earlier. That's that. That's the easy entrance. We'll go over here to the other side. Anyway, yeah, the password gives you access to the terminals. Except there was that one terminal that you saw. Let's actually go revisit that over here by the dead gunners. This one is closed down right now. And it's because of the power. The main power is offline. So when we go to the power plant later, I kind of... <laughs> a little bit of foreshadowing. When we go to the power plant later on in the walkthrough, we'll be hitting that up. And this is the other um, entrance Well, here. Did we... I don't even think we went up here, did we? Let's go up here first. See where all this goes to. Just kind of wraps around. Fusion core removed. It's okay. I got plenty of fusion cores because they're not that, I don't know, they're not that scarce. And then this is the, yeah, okay, so this leads up here. So I believe it leads. And now for a special surprise. Gives access to this, this one right here, if I'm not mistaken. member of our family. Nuka-Cola Quantum. Or the stab one, one of them. Anyways, either way, it's not important. Let's drop down here. We got the password. We access all the terminals. If you didn't have the hacking skill that I do, then you got the password for them, So, or whichever one you needed. Let's go in here. And this is where you do this to unlock the door. Oh, it's already unlocked. All right, and then we'll go ahead and exit. We'll go ahead and get Clark's stash next, because we've got to do that. This is like the, uh... I hope I have the key. Do I still have the key on me? Clark's stash key? I wonder. Uh, I should probably check that. If not, I'm going to have to like end the episode right here. And then go get it, and then like do it next episode. Let's see. I do have it. Of course I do. I don't even know if you can really put away keys, if I'm being honest. Okay, so we need to... Where's the map? Let's pull out the map. There we go. The bridge is over here. You know, we'll just cut through here. We're gonna go hit up the bridge. It's underneath the bridge. We'll go ahead and grab the goodies and then, uh... I guess end the episode, or maybe... You know what? No, I have an idea. Because this episode's already gonna be long. Well, it's gonna be a two-parter. I can tell you that right now, but... This way, it'll save me travel time getting to the safari zone. So we'll go ahead and access the safari zone. I believe it's this bridge where the stash is at. I'm gonna go ahead and put away this power armor too. I don't want to bring it to the. Uh, I don't want to bring it with me. I don't like power armor. You guys know that. I've been doing this like whole walkthrough without power armor. There it is, Clark's stash. Nuka K token ten, and then you get a uh, one of each of these. I guess <laughs> so cool. Get to see what all of these do. Nuka Cola Orange. I'll take that one. 
I'll take the quantum because I already have a few of those. This restores the shit out of your action points. Wow. I don't really want the wild. Great. Um, yeah, okay, I'll take that one too. Cool, okay. So, yeah, let's... Let's go do that then. Why not? Let's go ahead and cross over here. Very slowly because we're in power armor. You know what? We'll take it this way. Is he shooting something? You guys hear that? It's like. Duh, 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 duh. Can we not, like, get up here? Really? Oh my god. I do want to figure out what that noise is, though. It's weird. All right, let's go over here. I'll just jump up over here. Wait. You see that? You see that in the water? What is that? Weird. Wow. Woo! Glitch as hell. I wonder what's going on. I wonder. All right, whatever. I gotta leave that alone for now. These guys are actually hostile. You'd be like, "Wow, man, why, why are you killing cows?" But they are hostile, so that's why I killed them. <laughs> they're not like regular Brahmin. They're like wild ones that are all mutated and evil. Here's the bridge. It's so weird. I wonder where it went and why it's doing that. Anyway, here's the safari zone. And after uh, after I get this, discover this location, I'm gonna end the episode and I'm gonna go return this power armor and go buy like some fusion cells and shit and do all that. So yeah, there's a guy fighting him, but we're gonna save that for next episode. Why isn't it discovering it for me? I want to fast travel here. There we go. Cool. Ding, ding. All right. Well, cool. Um, yeah. So next episode, we're gonna be right here at the entrance to this place. We haul ass over here. This is where we'll end it. We'll just watch him fight that gator claw. We're gonna haul ass back to this entrance, or we're gonna appear here. Except I won't have any. He's kicking that gator claw's ass. <laughs> How much health does he have? He has like no health. I don't think he can die though. I'm gonna enjoy this. Sure there we go. All right. <laughs> so, anyways, next episode will begin here. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel for more content like this. My name is Brian. We'll go talk to that guy too. My name is Brian, and hopefully, I will see you in the next one.